Hello and welcome to the Trailmakers Olympics. Now, Trailmakers is a game about cooperation, teamwork, and building stuff. I don't want to do any of that. So we're going to take me and two of my friends and we're going to compete in arbitrary challenges. Let's hand it on over to Ryan for the rules. Okay, so the rules are simple. It's a timed race that starts at the bottom and ends at the green on top of the mountain. Resets are allowed, but they're just a little tricky. And then thrusters can be used only for downforce. And of course, no glitches. Oh, f that. I don't want to be this high up. Thank you, Ryan, for the rules. Man, it, that dude sure is handsome. Huh? All right. Now we got them rules out of the way. Let's take a look at each competitor's vehicle. Alrighty, first up, we got the Noodle. It's designed by me. I made it flexible. It is the heaviest, but also the most powerful. Now we got the Sedan on a Diet. Designed by Odysseus, he stripped everything down. It is the lightest vehicle. It is also the fastest. We'll see if that's enough to get him first place. And lastly, we got the Spider, designed by Alvin. He focused entirely on grip. It's by far the most complex vehicle, but it is super well-rounded overall. We'll see if he's got what it takes. We're all going oh. separately. Hold. I was born to climb. Cool, okay. I think my strategy is just going to be to go up. All right. Come on, baby. Oh no! Whoa. Honestly, it climbs <laughs> just as good without the other tire. Uh, Odysseus, that's an interesting choice. Looking like you're gonna go down the uh, the f uh, canyon there. It's tough. Yeah, I am. Holy shit, dude! Oh, keep it together, brother. Go. Just gotta crawl up here like I'm a little snake. I'm a little snake man. I'm the snake man. Looks like we got our two leaders stuck. Let's take a look at them. Oh, yep. Looks like Odysseus got himself stuck in the moose snatch. Very tough place to get out of here. Looks like Alvin found his way out of the situation. We're gonna have a winner here, folks. Just unlucky there, Odysseus. I'm fucking pissed. I, I, I... I've fallen, and what? I can't get up! No, you gotta make it to What's the up? green for it to count, right? Do you? For the green? It's a timed race that starts at the bottom and ends at the green on top of the mountain. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, at the end. Ate it. Do you want to hear something funny? It was my idea to do rock climbing. I'm the one that edits the videos, and I lost so badly I had to cheat so that it wouldn't be two minutes of me slowly crawling up the mountain after everybody had finished. Anyway, let's go to the results. Welcome to the map, Danger Zone. The second event of this video is High Throw, and it will take place right here. The rules are simple. Throw the thing as high as you can with no power cores allowed. We're going to treat it like it's a high jump or a pole vault event, where we're going to start out at a low height and then slowly increase it until there's a winner. 
So we got a little problem with high throw. Uh, how can you tell exactly how high you're throwing a thing? We tried using this little wall here, but it's not even close to, uh, to tall enough. I tried using this little thing that I used in the rock climbing clip to film, and then I improved it, made a better one, but even still, you're always stuck eyeballing stuff. So instead, we've decided to use altitude blocks, and we had our graphics team go ahead and create a very high budget thing to show you how that works. Let's give each competitor a chance to explain their vehicle. It's to be blocky. Rectangle. Perfect. I guess for people that haven't done high jump or pole vault, he failed three times at this height of 115, so that means he's out. And three strikes, you're out for Alvin. Did you see that? That was me. I won. Me. That feels kind of good to win, you know. Hey, you know what? I'm editing this video. Let's do a let's do a race next, you know. And the rules are simple. It's just a normal race. Oh, let's go! I just made you my bitch! <laughs> Did you hit the gap? Oh, I hit right. the gap. You know what the solution is, mate? What's that? Right. Internal combustion. Yeah, it's well. the solution to everything. Speed and power. How? I just got lucky. I have oh. no clue. I hit the ground and it stopped me dead. Damn. Let's go, dude. That was so pretty. Okay. Two things. One, I went the wrong fucking Wee! way because I didn't go off the cliff. And two, I don't believe you hit the gap. Oh, would you look at that? I win again. You know what? I think I found a way to win every time. So let me introduce to you the boys. Alrighty, what's up gamers? Today we're going to do some challenges. Are you guys ready? Are you, are you ready to lose is the question. <laughs> your desire to win is caused by your low self-esteem and measuring your self-worth by comparing yourself to others. You know what? Let's do a, a first person to touch this tree on this map. Me. I win. Me. Hey, sweetheart. Hey. Uh, I'm filming right now, but I'm trying to figure out how to do like a God complex thing. But it's like funny. But I also need to be like a little bit of a cunt. Just be yourself. <laughs> <laughs> anyway. Okay, next challenge. First person to make a uh, airfoil boat. Oh, look at that. I win again. Okay, next challenge. First person to make a uh, speed glitched airplane. Me. Let's take a look at our standings now. I am Ozymandias. Gaze upon my works in despair. And you guys thought I forgot about the chickens, huh? Uh-uh, not me. Okay, dude, I think we got it, dog. I think that's that's a fucking ring dinger, bro. Ring dinger. A ring dinger. Incredibly well rounded. Well, well, well rounded. Well rounded. Incredibly well, well, well rounded. Well rounded.
incredibly well wound, well, well fucking rounded, well fucking rounded, well rounded, well rounded, well rounded.